affirm for things in your life in a normal way as opposed to a rigid robotic way hello everyone welcome back to the channel my name is danielle or danny and i want to come to you guys with a video today about how important it is to take it easy if you feel like you're not manifesting the things that you desire to have or if you feel like you're being overwhelmed with anxiety about whether your manifestations are coming or not. I am a spiritual advisor and I'm also a conscious mindset coach. So if you would like to know anything about what I do when it comes to one-on-one -on -one coaching, I have some free courses and some paid courses. Check out my description box down below. In this video, I'm going to share something that Neville says about taking the path of least resistance. This is something that absolutely can help you to manifest a lot easier, a lot quicker. Now, I'm not going to sit here and tell you that you have to let go of your desires in order to manifest. Let's just dive into why it's important for you to take your manifestations off a pedestal. When we give too much attention to things, what we are saying to our subconscious is that in order for me to manifest and feel happy or to say that the law of assumption works, this has to happen. This way, this way, this way, this way. You see how rigid and how bottled up you are. Your body naturally responds to when you are saying your affirmations in a normal way. And I have a video that I shared with you guys about a week ago about how to affirm for things in your life in a normal way as opposed to a rigid robotic way. And I'm going to tell you guys this, that I have manifested many things doing repetition. However, I have manifested beautiful things, things beyond my wildest dream when I allowed life to unfold in a way that was effortless. So I'm going to give you guys a perfect example of how to do this. Here's what Neville says about the most effortless way that you can manifest. And this is very exciting. So listen up. Okay, so the power of awareness, chapter 14, Neville says, therefore, in moving from your present state to the state desired, you must use the minimum energy and take the shortest possible time. Your journey from one state of consciousness to another is psychological. So to make the journey, you must employ the psychological equivalent of least action and the psychological equivalent is your mere assumption. Okay. So there you have it. If you are looking to manifest things a lot quicker, I want you to take into account that your life is unfolding the way that it's unfolding because you have been focusing on thoughts, inner conversations, and those things are now showing you what your whole inner conversations and your self-talks have been. So how do we change this? How do we get back into the flow, the easiness of things. Start to learn how to relax, how to get your thoughts to slow down so that you're aware of what you're saying to yourself, what you're calling into your life. Once you do that, you'll start to see that your life is going to unfold in a beautiful way. It's gonna unfold the way that you want it to unfold because when you take the path that is the least effort, what you're saying to your subconscious is that this is normal for me to have. I am manifesting things wonderfully in my life because this is normal. It's normal for me to be in love with my SP. It's normal for me to have all the money that I desire to have. And it's normal for me to live a beautiful life. You guys have a beautiful day wherever you are and I'll talk to you later.